everyone, Renee here. If you are looking for a 30 minute rebounder workout, then you are in the right place. In today's workout, we are going to complete a 5K right here on our mini trampoline. Yes, 3.1 miles of rebounding. So put on your favorite music and hop up on your mini trampoline. Let's get started. So you wanna bring your feet hip width apart and parallel, soft bend of your knees to protect your joints, find your core engagement. So navel pulls up, tailbone points down, and engage your entire core region. Hand on your hips and just begin with the basic bounce. So you're lifting your heels ever so slightly, keeping the balls of your feet on the trampoline, and you're already going to feel your muscles engage and contract right in your midsection. Chest is proud, shoulders down, and put a little smile on your face because we are going to have fun, and I hope you have your favorite music playing. This 30 minutes is gonna go by fast. If you need a longer warm up, pause this video, head on over to my mini trampoline playlist, and I have a nice five minute warm up over there, and then come back and hit play once again here with me. Okay, so as you're warming up, I'm going to explain how the workout is going to take place. So it's going to be about 30 minutes. We get about 3.1 miles in a 30 minute rebounder workout, so it's gonna average right around there. I will start my watch when we start the workout so I can keep track of how many miles we have gone throughout this entire workout, so it's gonna be fun. We have, we are going to complete a move for 30 seconds, and then during our 30 second rest recovery, it's not really a rest, it's an active recovery period, we are simply going to march or walk it out. So that's what will be every other 30 seconds, will just be a walk or a march, or if you're feeling up to it, you can always take high knees, so you do whatever feels good to you. Throughout this workout, I'll give you many options. So we have a move, then we have the walk march section, then another move, then the walk march section. Remember, you do not have to remember this, but each little part's only 30 seconds. So you're gonna wanna push yourself throughout, and it's just 30 minutes here with me. Okay, bring your arms on right side, take a deep breath in, arms over it. And exhale, arms reach down. Let's do that again. Inhale, and exhale. Shoulders away from your ears. Start to get your mind right. I'm gonna show you the first move and then I will start our timer. So the first move is simply alternating knee up. So you're just gonna go right and left, okay? Just like that and you will have the option to add a little swing of your arms, just as if you're skipping through the park. Yes, okay, so we're gonna have fun. Remember, working out should be fun, you should enjoy it. So let me start our timer, that's our first 30 seconds. That's it, we're here. You have eight more seconds, just basic bounce. We're for it. I'm gonna start the timer. Ready? Two, one, go. March, swing. Yes, okay. So we're just, think of skipping, having fun. You're just alternating which knee lifts. If you want to do the arms, do them. If it causes you to fall over, then bring your hands to your hips. But you do you. Find your core right away from the start. Chest is proud. You just have 10 more seconds already in this move, and that's it. And then we're gonna bring it to the walk or march or high knees, whatever you're feeling like. Last set, here you go. Okay, I'm gonna do high knees simply because I'm feeling revved up, ready to go. We just started this workout, so I'm pumped. We're in it together. So right away, this is our active recovery. But yes, we're working hard, we're working strong. But remember, make it work for you. Rest and recover, don't quit, stay with me. You have eight more seconds. And then we're going right into wide feet hops. Three, two, one. Feet go wide, and you just little hops, arm circle overhead. Yes. Okay, so keep that nice soft bend of your knees, and you're hopping. This is a little bigger of a hop than the basic bounce. Your entire foot should be coming off the trampoline, and your entire foot presses down to the trampoline. I love that this also opens up our upper body to help Put our posture into place. You only five more seconds. It's gonna go by fast. I told you two, one. Okay, high knees, march or walk. Whatever feels good to you. I'm still going with the high knees. Bring your knees up to hip height. Your back should stay flat. So you don't wanna lean back. You want it nice and tight. If anything, think of leaning forward just a little bit and that'll be the right position. Breathe. Already breathing heavy, but we're having fun because why not? Yes. Next one. In three, two, one. Bring your feet together and we're gonna hop it side to side. Yep, bring your arms up if you would like and add a little side bend. So you're working your entire side body. These nice little hops. Feet are close together here. 
So it makes your balance work a little bit harder. Those tiny stabilizing muscles need to fire up. And that's amazing. Remember, to, when we work the tiny muscles, it helps to support the bigger muscles. So it all works together. Three, two, one. Already back. Okay. I'm doing high knees still. Yes. Woo! Moving fast. We want to get our three miles in in 30 minutes. So it's no joke. We're actually more of a run, more of a jog here. Nice work. Keep going. See, who said walking or running needs to be boring? It doesn't. Our cardio can be fun. Because we're rebounding. Three, two, one. One, okay, bring your feet together, hop forward, back. So wide forward, then you zip your legs together in the back. Whew. Yes, if you'd like to add your arms, send your arms out in front of you, pull your elbows back every time you hop forward. Whew. Whenever you have upper and lower body working together, get your heart rate that much higher. Whew. Yes, you have 10 more seconds, and then right back to walk, march high knees, whatever. Maybe you're rubbed up and you want to sprint it out. Kind of feeling like a sprint. Ready, go. Okay, this is your three seconds. Maybe you're recovering and you're walking. Maybe you're high knees, or maybe you're feeling up for it and you're sprinting with me. Why not? Woo! Give it a try, you have 15 seconds. Yes. Whew. Nice work. Remember, do what feels good, and this just felt needed. We just need it to push it a little bit faster. Three, two, one, great job. Okay, now we're going right into fast feet. So this is just little knee lifts, pressing down into the trampoline. Nice work, woo! Feet go wide, feet go narrow. Yes, nice and wide, woo! Bring it in. You have 10 more seconds here, and then we're already five minutes in. Breathing heavy, right here with me. Three, two, one, okay, active recovery. Maybe you high knees, maybe you sprint. I'm ready for another sprint. Let's do this, or maybe you're walking it out. If you choose, make this recovery. You can always stop and get a sip of water, too, during these nice little walking sections. Push it, strong. Woo, 12 seconds. Yes. Breathe, chest is proud, abs are in. Three, two, one. One, okay, now we're gonna single hop it side to side. Whew. Yes. You can always tap that back foot if you need to, but I'm finding balance here. Whew. So think mini skaters. You've done this on the floor, I'm sure, in some of your workouts. You're just hopping and crossing one leg back. You're gonna feel your glutes, your hamstrings. Whew. Yes. Nice work. Keep going a little faster, a little stronger. Okay, back. And this time, I'm just gonna high knees. Yes. Woo! Nice work. We've gone just about half a mile here. So we're right on track. We're gonna be right around 30 minutes. 3.1 miles. We're moving strong. Eight more seconds. Your active recovery. And then we're going into front punches. Three, two, one, okay. So you just have a hop and you alternate punching forward. Yeah, so keep your core engaged. You have that nice soft bend of your knees. Think of scooping out your abs. So what you wanna think is that someone maybe is trying to punch right in at your belly button and then you scoop your abs away. Yeah, feel that. Feel that power. Woo! Remember your core. Stabilize you, it's your powerhouse. It's so important to make it strong. Three, two, one. Okay, I'm ready for a sprint, but that's your active recovery. So you can walk, you can high knees, you can march, or sprint. I just felt like I needed a sprint. Whew. Yes. I love workouts that push me, and I love to be pushed right along with you. We're doing this together. It's not easy, but it's worth it. You're worth this time. Woo! Abs in, three, two, one. Okay, alternate front kicks, right, left, side to side. Maybe you take a step out from the middle and you just kick, kick. 20 seconds of these kicks. 
Navel pulls in. Your core has to support you because at any given time, you're on one foot. Nice work. Eight more seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, high knees, march, or walk it out. Woo! Or sprint if you're up for it. Woo! Remember, I'm just here to guide you. You know what's right for you and your body. We're just working together, but I want you to feel your best, do your best, push yourself. Yes, just past your comfort zone, but not to the point that you wanna give up, because you won't. You push yourself right to your edge, and then maybe you leap over it. Three, two, one. Okay, right, kick right front, kick right to the side. Come, front, side. Okay, we're here for 30 seconds. Just your right side for this 30 seconds. And then we'll go to our recovery of marching high knees. Not sure we can call it a recover anymore since we've added sprints in. But we'll go to the next section there. Whew. One more. Yes. Okay. Choose your level. We're back to the marches, high knees, sprints, or walks. Remember, do what you need in this moment. If you're like, I need to take it up a notch and sprint it out. I'm all for that. If you're thinking you need to take it down a notch, then do that too. Be proud of whatever you choose. We're taking on the left in three, two, one. Okay, kick front left to the side. Front to the side. Yes. Nice work. Abs are in. Beautiful. We're doing it together. Stronger than ever. Core's engaged. You have five more seconds and back to whatever you choose. Last one. Okay, I'm sprinting because I'm feeling up for it. But you can always walk it out, march it out, high knees. Or you're trying to sprint with me. 20 more seconds. Yes. Woo! Wonderful. We're about 10 minutes in. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, whoo, 4, 3, 2, 1. Okay. Pendulum side to side, or you're just tapping it side to side. Either one. Go. Bring your arms up. Add a little side. Yes. Woo! Nice work. 10 minutes in. Of just about 30 minutes. Probably gonna be just over 30 minutes. But it's worth it to feel good, amazing, and be proud of yourself. Four, three, two, one. Okay, I'm high knees, but you go to your level. Whatever you're choosing here in this moment, do it now. Find your path. Woo! Abs are in. That's what's lifting your knee up to hip height. You have just about 12 more seconds. I'm ready to sprint it out for these last 10 seconds. Why not? We're going into alternating heels towards our glutes. Three, two, one. Okay, heel to glute. Yes. Nice work. You can lose the bounce in between. Just go heel, 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 heel. 20 seconds. Yes, a little faster. We've just hit our one mile mark. One mile done. Woo! Yes. Keep going. You're strong. You're empowered. You have five more seconds. And then we're taking it back to whatever it is your recovery is. Last one. Ready? I'm sprinting. Just up for it. 30 seconds. But remember, if you need to recover, walk it out. Or get a sip of water and join us right back here. Yes. We're working for our 5K, 3.1 miles. We're gonna be 12 minutes in in 10 seconds. And we're going out and in. Four, three, two, one. Okay, legs go out and arms up and down. Yes. Smile, squeeze inner thighs, press out with your outer thighs. 
Arms stop at shoulder height. So you're gonna feel your upper body. You're pressing down into your trampoline and you smile. Keep your chest proud. 10 more seconds and then back to whatever you're choosing in this moment. Three, two, one. Remember, you can simply walk it out just like this or take it up to march where you step in between or you high knees, just showing you all your options or you sprint it out. 15 more seconds. Yes, get it strong. This is when you tell yourself you are absolutely unstoppable. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, just a front kick right. Yes, okay. Arms are going up and then press down. But you're staying on the right side. Nice work. Woo! You're tapping your right toes down ever so lightly, but the work is in your left side. 10 seconds left, and then back to your active recovery. Five, four, three, two, one. Go, I'm sprinting, because why not? Woo! Yes. Stronger, knees up to hip height, your chest is proud. 20 seconds, and then we're taking those kicks on the left. 15 seconds. Nice work. You're getting healthier and stronger every single moment that goes by. You're almost just about halfway through this workout. Three, two, one. Okay, kick left. Stay left. Yeah, so same thing, other side. Abs nice and tight. Back is flat, arms press down. Remember, you're gonna feel this more on your base leg than the one that's moving. Of course you're gonna feel it on the one that's kicking, but major on your base leg. Eight more seconds. Yes, and then guess what? We're almost 15 minutes in, about halfway. Three, two, one, go. I'm sprinting again. Woo! Yes. I'm breathing heavy with you. Yes, we are working hard together. Remember that, you're not in this alone. This is not easy, but you're strong and empowered. You're better for it. 10 more seconds. Maybe you take it up a notch for these final 10 seconds here. Then we're just going into tiny little tucks. Three, two, one. Okay, so you just tucks. Okay, so this is a tiny tuck. Little hitch forward from your waist. Glutes behind you, nice flat back on the diagonal. And then you're thinking of folding yourself in half. Knees lift ever so slightly. Yes. So you're gonna feel your navel contract to make this move happen. 10 more seconds, press your heels down into the trampoline. Yes. Little tucks here, five, four, three, two, one. Okay. You can do whatever you're feeling like right now. I went right to high knees. But remember, you can always walk it out, march it out, or if you're still feeling intense, sprint it out. Yes, 15 seconds. Woo! Nice work. After this, we're going into heel clicks. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, feet go wide. Click, click. Okay, squeeze your pelvis, squeeze your core, squeeze your inner thighs. Press out with your outer thighs. Yes. Nice work. You're popping high, squeezing inward. 15 seconds. And then back to your recovery. Or not. If you're sprinting, that's not a recovery. We all know that. Three, two, one, go. Woo! I just went into marches for a moment. I need to catch my breath. Remember, this is just fine and amazing, just like this, or we're gonna sprint it out. 15 seconds, why not? After this, we're going to single hop on the right. Woo, yes. You're gonna burn out that standing leg, your base leg. Smile still, two, one, okay. Right side, think of bringing your left heel towards your glute, and you're gonna feel your left hamstring isometrically hold there. Yes, your left knee's pointing down, 
you're stabilizing on your right. 15 more seconds. And we're taking it to the march section. Or the sprint, or the walk, wherever you're at. We've already gone 1.6 miles. Ready, go, sprint. Whatever you're up for, I'm sprinting. Nice work. Yes, this is intense. But that's why you're here, to push yourself and see just how far you can take it. 15 more seconds. Just when you felt like giving up, push through a few more. And you'll surprise yourself. I bet you will. I know you will. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, left leg this time. So right heel towards your glute, right hamstring holding tight. And you're pressing into your left heel. Yes, so you're working both sides. Abs in, stand up tall. 15 more seconds. You are just about 20 minutes in. And you're 1.7 miles in to this. Be proud. Two, one, go. Why not? Might as well sprint. At this point, just keep pushing. Keep going. Woo! You're just about two thirds of the way done with this rebounder workout. Two thirds of the way to the end, to the finish line. You versus you. Next one's fine. Jumping jacks with a little different arm movement. I'll show you. Ready? Here we go. Regular jumping jack, then arms go forward. Out and up, forward up. Woo! I just thought it was fun. Change up the arms. Change up our mind. Makes us think a little more. Mind to muscle. You have just under 15 seconds. Keep going. Yes. Nice work. Five more seconds. And then back to whatever active recovery you'd like. Last one. Go. I'm sprinting. After this, we've been going for 20 minutes. Yes. 20 minutes on the clock. 20 seconds left of whatever you've chosen for this part of the workout. This part, it's totally up to you, totally adaptable to whatever you're in the mood for, and it can change each and every time you come back here. <sighs> Woo! Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, so you can alternate just tapping your toes just like this, or bring it up a notch and tap, and tap, tap, and tap. Or you go tap, 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 tap. <sighs> yes. And just like that, you're in it. 15 more seconds. Think inner thighs flare up toward the ceiling each and every time. Yes. Smile. Three, two, one more each way. Okay. Right now I'm marching it. Yes. Needed a breather or I'm going to change it up. Go to high knees. High knees, you really work your core here with this and your balance. You're gonna feel each leg as it presses down into the trampoline. Nice work, 10 more seconds. Then we have a little twist punch on the right. Um, stay right for this first 30 seconds, ready? Go, you're gonna punch right, punch right. Yes, so a little twist of your body when you punch with your right arm out to the side. Your feet are essentially staying the same distance apart you're just rotating your entire body. 15 more seconds. And then we're heading back to your active recovery or your intense recovery, however you want to call it. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, I'm sprinting again. We're getting close. You have just about a mile left to go on this workout. One more mile, just over. Okay, so you do you. We'll get there. We'll just be over 30 minutes. Woo! Woo! Yes. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Okay, punch left, center, left. So same thing, just punch it with your left forward. So again, feet are relatively the same distance apart 
the entire time and they stay just like that as we twist you're gonna feel this in your obliques in your core 10 seconds yes and then back to that recovery we can even call it that three two one I'm sprinting yes you do you maybe you try a sprint or maybe you start off with a little walk to catch your breath and then you join me here 20 seconds yes Woo. and then we have a fun little knee combo nice work yes breathe maybe you close your eyes five four three two one okay knee combo you're gonna go right left right hold left right left hold right left right left right left i certainly feel my obliques here yes nice work abs are engaged to so hold your leg up at hip height five more seconds and then back to that 30 second whatever you'd like one more full round okay i'm sprinting 30 seconds sprints after this we have low little kick flicks i'll show you kind of fun remember abs are pulled in just as proud yes always do a body scan body assessment to make sure that your form is on point the better your form the more you'll get out of each and every workout the more effective and efficiently you can work three two one okay flick flick so see just a little flick nice and low this time it's kind of fun yes okay we have gone 2.2 miles we're getting so close we have less than a mile to go here we're going for 3.1 miles a 5k with me back is nice and flat so you're not leaning back stay upright three two one go sprinting yes i'm sprinting i know you know your options but i can't help it i want to just push that finish line is so close I'm ready to push it until the end nice work 15 seconds and then we're going into lunge hops with your right leg back high lunge position you'll pull your knee to your chest no worries i got you you'll see it in just a moment three two one okay lunge position yep so you're just like that beautiful you're here for 30 seconds crunching in with your core your chest stays proud so no hunching in your shoulders think crunching in your in your abs so pull your navel back yes 10 seconds Woo! let's go let's do it three two one okay go sprinting once again we're so close let's do this remember your options though you can take any variation you would like maybe a combo of some of them so maybe you walk march high knees but now we have 15 seconds maybe you sprint it out now we're taking those same lunge hops, but left leg this time is moving. Yes. Five, four, three, two, one. Left leg back. Hop, hop. 30 seconds. Pull navel towards your spine. Everything in, everything tight. 20 seconds here. Yes. When you close your eyes, you know this move. Remember, think of tucking your hips. Navel pulls in, little curve in your abs and your lower spine. Five seconds, four, three, two, one. I'm going to sprint. We're at 2.4 miles. Yes, you've got this. About half a mile left. You've come this far. Do not give up on yourself now or ever. What you do here in this workout will carry on to the rest of your life. So push it and show yourself how capable and strong you are. You go. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, X jumps. Woo! Just like that. We're in it. 30 seconds. Or you can take this into regular jumping jacks or tap it side to side. Okay? But I'm here for it. 
I love a good X jump, especially when we're tired and we need to push through until the end. After this, we're going to our recovery. Now I suggest to actually recover because our next two moves, we're sprinting during those opposite 30 seconds. Ready, go. Okay, okay, so actually recover here because you have this 30 seconds and then the next 30 seconds is a full on sprint. Nice work, beautiful. So choose your recovery, but I promise you're gonna wanna recover. Bring your heart rate down just a little. We're moving, we're cranking. Ready? Sprint it out, go. Okay, so this is a 30 second sprint. Try to push yourself here. You can always take a modification. Remember, don't quit, modify your rest. So you can do that. But try to push yourself because after this, we're gonna go into active recovery. But this is not the active recovery, this is the push. This is the zone. You have 10 more seconds that you try to take it up a notch. Five, four, faster. Three, two, one. Okay, maybe you march with me. We're bringing our heart rate down. Yes, okay. We have another sprint coming up. Nice work. We're pushing it at the end here. Okay, we're at 2.6 miles. We're getting close, but we're not there yet. We're just about at our 30 minute mark. So we'll probably need a couple more minutes over that, but not much. You can, ready, ready, go. Sprint, okay. This is the push once again, not the recovery. So sprint it out. Keep going a little faster. Remember, you see the finish on that 5K that you're doing with me. Indoors on your trampoline, so no pain in your joints. This is all you. But that finish line is right there, it's reachable. You're getting so close. This is where we need to mentally push. Physically, you can do it. Mentally, that's where you're struggling. So no, you can. Two, one. Okay, recover. Yes, let me see where we're at. Okay, we are at 2.67 miles. You are so close. Nice work. Beautiful. Okay, we are going to take it to those fun jumping jacks. The little combo we did earlier. Arms go out and around and then forward and around. So we'll have 30 seconds there. We're gonna finish this off strong. One more each leg. Go. Jumping jack. Woo! Yes. Nice work. Beautiful. 30 seconds. And you're smiling. We're doing this. Okay, we're just over 30 minutes. But we'll be doing our 3.1 miles in no time. Probably less than a couple minutes we'll be able to get there. Yes. Two, one. Okay, I'm sprinting. Even though this is your active recovery, so you can take whatever level you need to, but after those jumping jacks, I'm ready to sprint. Nice work. You can, you will. You'll succeed. Woo! Yes. Keep going. You have 10 more seconds. Then we're gonna take a little combo. I'll show you. No worries. Okay, we're at 2.8 miles. Three, two, one. Okay, so you go half forward, back, heel, click, heel, click. Forward, back, click, click. Yes, keep going. Nice work. 20 seconds of this move. You're in it. We're in it together. We're in it to win it, to finish strong. And winning is simply finishing because it's always you versus you. Always has been, always will be. One more set. Okay, active recovery or sprint it with me. We know that the end is in sight. We know we're almost there. So this is where you give it everything you have. Like do not hold back because we're coming to the end. Don't hold out on yourself here, now, or ever, you are stronger than you give yourself credit. You are worthy of this time. So just know that a healthy you is a loving you. What are we at? 2.9. Yes. Three, two, one. Woo! Okay, you ready? 
We're gonna bounce. Now we're taking it back to those X jumps. Three, two, one, go. Jump, jump. Or you can take your options, your modifications. Yes, nice work. Nice and strong. 10 more seconds here, then back to your march, walk, high knees, or sprints. Two, one, go. I'm sprinting. Yes. Woo! Let me see where we're at. We're almost to that three mile mark. So close. You're at 2.97 miles. Wow. You've made it so far. After this, we're taking this into skiers. Okay? Eight more seconds. Push it. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay. Skiers. Just like this. Okay. We've hit the three mile mark. 0.1 miles. That's it. That'll be less than a minute. That's all you have. Okay. So we have skiers for about 15 more seconds. Then we're going to have 30 seconds to do whatever you would like when it comes. You can either walk, march, high knees, or sprint for your final 30 seconds. You are rounding the home stretch. We're coming on to the straightaway. Three, two, one, go. This is your straightaway. That finish line is 30 seconds away. Yes, go faster, go stronger. 20 seconds right now, right here. Beautiful, abs are in, nice and tight. Yes. Okay. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. You're done. 3.1 miles right here. 34 minutes. That's it. Soften your knees. Let's bounce it out. Let's breathe it out. That was tough, but you're amazing. Okay. So bring it to your basic bounce just like we started. Balls of your feet are on the trampoline, heels lift ever so slightly, contract your core once again. So bring awareness back to your midsection here. Remember, your core wraps around your entire race, so it's not just your abdominals, you wanna think your lower spine as well. Okay, everything pulls in. In through your nose, out through your mouth. Be proud of yourself. Arms reach long way or side, take a deep breath in, arms reach overhead. And exhale, do that again. Inhale, and exhale. Okay, a few more basic bounds. We just wanna make sure we get our heart rate down. Our heart rate skyrocketed, especially with those sprints and those X jumps. Woo! That was intense, but fun. Okay, step it side to side. No one said it was gonna be easy, but it's gonna be worth it. I promise. And whatever you do here in your workouts will carry on for the rest of your life. Be proud of yourself. Okay, take your feet wide, arms reach long, soften your knees, take a deep breath in, arms reach overhead, and exhale. Make sure that you rest, you recover, you wanna stretch. I have some mobility workouts here. I'll link them at the end. I also have a five minute rebound or cool down and stretch. You might wanna do that, this was intense. Make sure that you're pairing this workout with some of my strength workouts, my resistance workouts so you can work your muscles and your cardio as well. You are amazing. Have an amazing rest of your day. Like and subscribe down below and let me know in the comments if you like this format. It was fun, it was intense, it was a good one. Have a great rest of your day. Goodbye everyone.